that idioms the one i have for you is good for those who think a lot imagine if you're thinking about something and people start offering you a penny for your thoughts wouldn't you become a millionaire soon you certainly would but not literally just figuratively yes the idiom we're going to talk about today is a penny for your thoughts that's right this idiom is an old old one let's first understand what it stands for a penny for your thoughts stands for something which is in your mind and someone wants to know about it yes simply if a person says a penny for your thoughts he or she means tell me what you're thinking that's absolutely right and where did this originate from it originated over 500 years ago and it was first used by an english statesman sir thomas more in one of his books which he wrote in 1522 called four last things and in it he used the idiom a penny for your thoughts the exact verbiage was as it often happens that the very face showeth the mind walking will groom it in such wise that not without some note and reproach of some vagrant mind other folk suddenly say to him a penny for your thought that's how it was first ever mentioned so it denotes when a person is requesting you to tell them what's there on your mind or what you're thinking another text where it was found was written by john hayward in 1547 in the proverbs and epigrams of john hayward where he mentioned in the second part freed caught the good man a penny for your thought so how exactly do you use it in a sentence when you speak to someone i have been observing you sitting quietly a penny for your thought what are your plans for the weekend a penny for your thought yes so that's how it can be used in english language there definitely are other idioms and phrases and words that can be used instead of this one like what's on your mind what's keeping you busy what are you thinking i'd like to know what you're thinking 